I have had uh, the pleasure this year of becoming friends with a porn star. Um, I never knew a porn star until this girl. And this girl is my favorite girl I've ever met. Uh, she's the hottest girl I've ever met that I know. And I don't say that because I got a type. I don't have any type. I don't fuck anything. I don't care. Uh, <laughs> I'm just kidding. But I do have a very Dr. Seuss approach to, to vagina. I fuck big girls and tall girls and fat girls and small girls. I don't, I don't you know. And I'm not picky. Everybody should get a shot. Why not? Anyway, I met this porn star this year named Bailey J, and she's become a good friend of mine. And uh, I love her. If you don't know who she is, she's she's the hottest girl ever. She's so she's got perfect jet black hair. It's just, just bangs, skin with these rosy cheeks. Teeth are perfect and white and sparkling. And she's got this angelic little voice and her lips and her tongue is so, ah, she looks so soft. And her boobs are great. And she's got this adorable butt. And she's got these hips, you just want to grab them. And she smells good and she's so just adorable. She's perfect. Um, <clears throat> she does have a, a penis. <laughs> <coughs> She's a transsexual. <laughs> Bailey used to be a guy, now she's a girl. And she's the hottest girl in the world. I want to hook up with her so bad. So bad, so bad. I see your face, miss, right now. Now, you're, you're, giving, a, you're giving a certain look, and I see the question behind those eyes. I know what you're wondering, but Joe, would you table your strict I don't give hand jobs policy? <laughs> yes, I would. Oh, I'd give her the sweetest hand job she's ever received. Not that she'd let me. Not that she'd let me. She's too hot. That's how out of my league she is. Having a dick doesn't bring her down into my league. <laughs> Do you know how hot you have to be as a woman to be like, yeah, cock, beat it, keep walking, buddy. <laughs> Whatever. <clears throat> Pretty fucking hot. People want to know, though. People want to know, you know? What would you do? What would you do if you're with her? What about her dick? What about her dick? It's like, well, dude, I don't, you know, I just, you know, it's, I look at her dick the way I look at the laundry. <laughs> get to it later. You know? <laughs> Got a lot on my agenda today. We'll get around to it. But we'll get there. So I've talked about this a lot um, on the podcast and, uh, and I've talked about it on Opie and Anthony a lot and stuff. And, uh, and uh, guys are close-minded. They just always go to the same question every time. Would you suck her dick? It's always that question, immediately. Would you suck her dick, Joe? She has a dick. Would you suck her dick? I don't know. I've never done that before. There are a lot of steps that lead up to sucking a dick. I don't know what my boundaries are. I don't know where I'd tap out. I really don't. Look. Let's just say we did go out on a date, right? Let's say me and Bailey went out on a date, okay? We're out, we're drinking, we're having a good time. Now we're in the elevator in my building, we're going up to the apartment, we're making out, we're grinding against the wall. <laughs> Suddenly I feel her boner <laughs> pressing up against my boner. <laughs> well, shit, I don't know. I might freak out right there. I might be like, no! way. I don't like things pressing up against my boner. Especially another boner. I'm not into that. Or, or, maybe I go firm. Come a little closer. That is very reassuring. <laughs> I felt it. Now let's get a look at it. So maybe I unbutton her pants. 
step two. Right? And there it is. And I grab it for a second. Maybe I go, what? No. No. Never touch the penis besides my own. I don't like that. Ah, these hands will never be clean. Or maybe I go, smooth. <laughs> like porcelain wrapped in fine silk. <laughs> this, this feels like a handful of marbles. When I was young, I like to put marbles in my mouth. <laughs> Let's give it a shot. So maybe I put it in my mouth. Maybe I put it in my mouth. Maybe I don't like it. Maybe I gag when I put it in my mouth. Maybe it makes me sick and I gag and I go, ah. <laughs> no. <laughs> or maybe it's this kind of gag. <laughs> We don't know what kind of gag it's going to be until we're there. But let's be honest, we're gagging and we're swallowing. Come on. I mean, you don't run up to home plate and not cross it. 